Hello, good morning crafting buddies. It's the 7th of December. I'm in the Netherlands, Ermelo, uh, Wilma here. And I've got something to share. Another video of two makes, day six and seven. Um, this is not an official collaboration video. Uh, mine is on the 9th. So that is on Saturday here. Okay, um, but I just wanted to share this with you. First of all, I've written down, if you want to look up all the makes and things and things that are published, then use the hashtag 2023DD, that's December Daily Advent, and you'll find it. TracyFoxCreative.com and on Etsy, it's Love Jug Journals, where you find the kit, the December Daily 2023 kit. Now, first on to this. This is a tag envelope and this is the back. So, you know, you've got two fun sides. This was a freebie. Tracy Fox donated that on her Tracy Fox website um, in the members area, but she explains in one of her videos. Now, I made this snowman tag. I use, as you see, I use red um, you can see it better at the back. I backed it with uh, packed it with um, paper from packaging, and and I made a little tassel or what's that called? Yeah, something at the front. I used paper and some glittery stuff. Well, red, you know, the festive season, and red thread. And here it's a tag and it's an envelope. Which, if you watch Tracy's video, you know how to put it together, construct it. And this is my number six. And here is this nutcracker. And I used a little label with two penguins, just because I love penguins. I also used my glitter pen. Can you see in the middle of the... That's a bit of glitter. And the other side, again, another ruffle or what's it called i don't know the word now help me out and this boy playing the flute i love the music theme in this kit there's a lot of music and carol singing going on and i love using that red uh, ribbon as well you'll find it in some of my makes i used metallic paper as a frame around this so lots of bling my day and number six it's nice the way it peeks out. <laughs> okay, on to day number seven, which was inspired by Corey. Corey is one of the collaborators in this uh, in this collaboration, and uh, she showed us how to make this um, little window. I did not have the correct um, punch, but then I used a die. And this die has, I used metallic paper again, it has some stitching, some little holes around, which I thought was rather neat. And you can also see that I used bling on the snowflakes in this Christmas tree. I like those styled Christmas trees. I have a little star at the, at the top. I used cabochon, cabochons, I don't know what they're called, cabochons in English. They're glass. And they've got something behind, in this case, these are gnomes. These are Christmas gnomes. I love them. <laughs> Here's my number seven. Put glossy accents on if you've seen things of mine in earlier videos. There's a Merry Christmas at the... F and uh, it's it's more dimensional because I put gar corrugated um, cardboard in between these... And so if you turn it over, that's the other side to the, um, yeah, it's, there's mesh in between. You can even, you know, so you can see through it. I had this Chinese mesh ribbon, which was just the right, just the right width. So that was lucky. I've been thinking, what can I use? Because I did not have what Corey had, but you can always think of things that you may have in your stash. Um, I also put a number seven at the back here, so I've got seven on both sides. While it's dangling, you know, you can see 
seven on both sides. I've got Merry Christmas in green here. And some more of these cabochons with gnomes. And here they're... Yeah, does it show? Yes, I think it does. I And I stitched, sewed around in red. I made a little sort of tree trunk of some paper I had. And I... And I'll show you the side so you can see that it's a rather, it's rather thick because it's all dimensional. The cabochons are glass and they are dimensional. So, just to me, I may set you thinking, maybe you find, and this of course is my whale tail, my latest acquisition. I love the whale tail tabs. I hope you like my two makes. And um, maybe I'll show you something tomorrow, but definitely my official video will be up on Saturday. Something to look forward to. Bye-bye um, for now. Enjoy just making anything, you know. Just enjoy doing the kit. You may not make all the days and don't be stressed about it. Just, just, just feel good. Feel good about watching others and take your mind of things. I have a lot to cope with and this takes my mind off it. So that's great. Bye bye.